Hey you guys, looking a little rough today. I think today is um, Wednesday. Anyways, um, yesterday I started noticing my throat was like getting raw, like I wasn't drinking enough water, just like that really parched feeling. But um, it carried on today and I have a headache and like my nose is stuffed up and anytime I like blow my nose, it's like straight liquid that comes out. It doesn't even have like a, a consistency of like boogers or anything. It's like straight liquid that's coming out. So. I'm going to go to Tesco and grab a few groceries and grab some cold medicine. Also, just upstairs I was finishing the touches of like our new home vlog and I looked down because Mariah is like playing through the makeup in my drawer and I looked down and she had opened like a red lip tar, you know, the kind that's in like the jar, the really pigmented stuff. It's like a jar and she got it like all over my black rug luckily I had the rug down because it's all over the black rug it was all over her all over her hands all over her face and then she got a few spots on the white carpet but um, I'm really worried about the carpet now just because like I'm paranoid about fees and homeowner people and stuff so I'm gonna go to the store and try and find some vinegar because I heard sorry I heard that you people use vinegar to get stains out so um yeah it's on my grocery list i'm planning on making taco bowls for dinner i just want to get some medicine and just like lay down for real though i don't feel good like at all i just got home i'm microwaving myself some hot water so i can have like a lemon and honey tea i thought i would show you guys what i got so i picked up two tesco sweet and salty popcorn cj and i love to snack on those we've both been having um some green or fruit smoothies in the morning so i pick up this unsweetened almond breeze milk some low-fat natural yogurt because i am making turkey burrito bowls tonight some more bananas some lemons for my throat and then we've also been making like infused water up some Thai jasmine rice for the burrito bowls picked up some raspberry jam CJ like only eats grape jelly but they didn't have grape and I know I don't know if he'll eat that I picked up some vinegar for the upstairs carpet which I will show you guys I have to find a spray bottle though these are for me like my whole jaw hurts you guys it's not fun I picked up some taco mixed beans so the recipe called for black beans but they didn't have it so I'm gonna try these it should be good though I picked up some hot sauce sorry I'll get in the natural lighting I picked up some hot sauce because it I don't know I looked for sour cream everywhere but not a lot of like countries like do sour cream like the United States does so that's why I got the yogurt and then the recipe says to mix the yogurt and the hot sauce together to like drizzle over the burrito bowl so that's what I got that for I got a couple of taco seasonings to season the turkey with. To garnish the burrito bowl, I picked up some tomato and garlic and an avocado, like a perfect ready to eat avocado because we already have one here, so it should be really yummy. I've never tried this burrito recipe before, but um we're trying to eat less beef or almost like no beef. So if you guys haven't seen Leonardo DiCaprio's documentary called like Before the Flood, it's talking about how much um, like beef production and like how much beef production contributes to the bad environment like with the methane that cows produce and how much like land and food and like force behind the meat industry. So if you can, I would definitely recommend that film. But um, yeah, even like chickens and turkeys, they take up like a minuscule percentage of what cows do to the environment. So we're trying to stick to turkey, chicken, and fish. Yeah, I picked up one more taco seasoning. And then I picked up some skinny nails because I have that. Oh, I have a big art piece that I got from TK Maxx that I need to hang up in my beauty room. And then I just got some all-in-one Beecham's for cough, nose, headaches, sore throat, aches and pains, and fever. So I'm going to pop this in. I'm going to get my tea going. And all I want to do is like lay on the couch, like I said, but um, I'm kind of paranoid about that carpet upstairs. So we're going to try and do that first. And then I think I'm going to clean a little bit. And then I just have the, like, this pressure on my nose, but I don't think it's allergies but I just have pressure, I don't know. But yeah, that's all I got. 
isn't it nice when you go grocery shopping and like you're eating healthy and you just like feel skinny you don't feel bloated I don't know I know like my double chin was like getting out of control but you guys that's what like PCSing does to you like everyone did you eat your are you ready for another piece <laughs> um hold on I'm gonna I'm gonna make her another another piece of peanut butter toast <gasps> yes I am see everyone I am a messy messy girl but I love some peanut butter. Well, grandma made me give you peanut butter because I guess you're supposed to give babies peanut butter now so they don't develop allergies. You ready for another one? You look so cute. Oh, look at all those teeth, you messy, messy girl. Okay, you guys, so I'm reading right here. It says use a quarter cup of white vinegar, one tablespoon of dish soap, and fill with water. Spray area liberally and let soak for five to 10 minutes and then proceed with blotting. Okay, so we're going to try that one. So I, this is the only empty bottle that I have right now. It's this like Mario Badescu facial spray bottle. So um, I'm going to fill it mostly, I guess like halfway with the vinegar and then add water and dish soap. You guys want to hear something ironic? So remember how I was whining about all the scuffs in my house? Well, when the movers came and brought the furniture in, remember I said there was only like one panel that was painted? Yeah, when they came and brought the furniture in, they scuffed it all up. So, like I should have never said anything. Like that was the world just telling me to like shut up. Here, let me show you. Okay, so we're in the hallway. Look. Yeah, it's like the whole stairway. So, uh, that's fun. It goes like all the way up. Anyway, so this is the bedroom. You can see the red stains on the carpet, so I'm trying to get those out. But what I'm really OCD about is how it got on the whites. So, yeah, let me try and get these out, you guys. If you know any, like, secret formulations, definitely leave them below yeah you need this in your life so i sprayed oh, hold on i sprayed the areas very generously and so i'm supposed to wait five to ten minutes and then start like dabbing it away I don't know, y'all. It doesn't really look promising. Uh, we're gonna see. I'm not really happy about getting a stain on the carpet like the first week that we've been here, huh? <laughs> okay, so it's probably been about 30 minutes. And I was going in, like you guys saw, like I filled that little spray bottle up with the vinegar. But I ended up needing a lot more than that. And I realized that like when I was getting it off Aya when she was covered in it, it wasn't coming off with just like regular soap and water. Like I had to use like a cleansing oil to get it off of her. So I came in and got some, where is it? So I brought my Yes to Soothing Cucumbers Micellar Cleansing Water. And I've been mixing this in and putting it on the carpet. So it came out of the black like really well. Like you can see it was right here, but if I didn't point it out, you could barely see it. As for the white part, I mean, it's still kind of there. I, what are you doing, ma'am? What are you doing? Okay, hold on. And then this one lightened up a lot. So, um, I don't really know. What are you doing, silly? What is that? What are you doing? So, yeah. I don't know. I'll probably work on it again tomorrow, but I need to go downstairs. <laughs> Gosh, give me some space. Why are you so obsessed with me? <laughs> oh, is that you? Look. You're so pretty with your mouth full of teeth. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, mommy's sick. That's you. Wow, rock star. 
You guys, I'm about to start dinner, but I also forgot to tell you guys that I bought some coriander, also known as cilantro, for only a dollar at Tesco. So over here we have mint, and now we are going to have cilantro that I'm going to use for the burritos tonight. Start on dinner, so I'm heating up four cups of water right now, and then I'm about to pour in there two cups of rice usually my rice always i feel like my rice takes longer than it says it says it's going to cook in 12 minutes but uh we'll see that's why i'm starting it now and this dish should actually be pretty fast and easy Now I'm going to go in with my turkey breast meat and I'm just going to put it on the skillet, let it cook for a little bit, and then put on the taco seasoning. Are you glad daddy's home? Now you can stop bothering me so much. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, she made the biggest mess today, babe. Okay, you guys, I mixed half a cup of yogurt with probably like six teaspoons of hot sauce. So now I have like this spicy, creamy drizzle, but you can totally use salsa. Like I should have just used salsa, but this is really good too. Hey you guys, so I'm trying out a new car mount. So if you guys are like focused on my boobs are pretty low, it's because like the angle that it is on my dashboard, it's like you guys can't, I can't put up the mirrorless screen so I can't really see what you're seeing. So hopefully it's okay. Um, I have a lot of little errands to run today. So yeah, it's the start of a four day and today is Friday, like I said, and we see Adele on Sunday. Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't think it's really hit me yet that we're gonna see her, and CJ and I are gonna go to our first concert in London. Like, it hasn't hit me yet. I feel like on the way there, I'm gonna be like, oh my gosh, this is real, but right now, like, I just feel like it's not real. But, um, so that's probably our only plans for this weekend, and then really just like unpacking, vacuuming, and settling into the house, because even though I've been doing it for like all week, we still have a ton of trash. It's like we were so unprepared when we left Okinawa, we ended up packing just a lot of things we don't need. So, um, totally gonna clear out the house, and actually, you know, my room, like I took the biggest room, and, um, I really don't need as much space as what's in there so I think um, we're just gonna put the guest bed in there and CJ's office in there because my parents actually booked tickets to come and see us in October they just did that yesterday so I'm like I'm not gonna just put them in like a small little room when my makeup room doesn't really get used that much especially like when they're gonna be here I don't see myself using my room that much so I think I'm gonna trade rooms and give CJ in that room just like a nice space. No! <laughs> 
Turn it off, Taylor! What's up guys? So the last thing that you guys saw was Nando's, but that was actually yesterday. I just didn't vlog after we had lunch, but I am currently, it is Monday, July 3rd, and I just have some pillows to return to HomeSense, which is like our home goods, because here they are right here. I have some clothes to donate as well, but they're kind of like a lavender mauve fluffy pillow. And I bought them for the living room, thinking I can tie in, like, kind of all the cool tones with my mixed metals, but they're just too purple pastel, so I, I'm i gonna get another metallic pillow that I'll show you when we got home, because I got one yesterday, but I realized I like the metallic one more than I like those ones, so I'm returning these. I think I'm gonna grab, like, a coffee and a croissant before... I head to HomeSense and Next Home. Next is a little bit more expensive than HomeSense, but maybe I can find some cool things in there too. So yeah, I just thought I would take you guys along with me. I am recovering from a cold currently, and I am by myself because CJ's at home with Mariah. So it should be a fun day. I have to pee, and let's get some coffee. Let me get my phone. <laughs> tutorial in probably like three months but I was just so excited to play with some new makeup I tried out the Ofra liquid lipsticks today you guys 